namaste pisces welcome back to my channel um for those who are new i welcome you as well and thank you for my monthly subscribers as always i'm grateful so what we will do pisces is um if you're a member meaning a monthly paid member you will be you will have access to all 12 signs and that's what how it will be for the rest of the year or season so far all right pisces because i know that some people like free things it's just all right um i think it's better to allow my monthly paid members to have access to the 12 signs um extended for the next couple of seasons so if i do post a reading for the other 12 signs it will be a partial reading and then it will lead you to the extended now uh pisces let's see wow something was left on the table so we do have the moon which is your energy pisces secrets okay so something could be secretive or you're holding on to a secret or you're not opening up to people all right again yeah keeping things to yourself all right because you want to make sure you have the right people near you so what is the messages for pisces wow okay so we have two cards that came out as well as the king of swords a crazy big gemini so something you can't see or something they cannot see and someone's refusing to see you have the you have the two of swords reverse and 11 11 which is a commitment and marriage um stability here um a crazy big gemini as well so someone could be secretly wondering about a commitment or um you might be wondering about committing all right a commitment that you're maybe you're dealing with someone let's see pisces energy we will also extend this reading to do the partner want to tell you and the hidden secrets you do have the hang man which is beautiful that came out as as all <laughs> excuse me pisces you have the two queens here so you have a queen of pentacles and a queen of cups which is reversed so you might be hanging and waiting, stuck. Maybe you're upset with someone. Someone is not really in your energy field right now. Um, King of Cups is reversed as well. So if you're done with the water sign, you might be upset with the water sign. Also, you have the Four of Cups and the King of Cups. Again, a lot of emotions here. And then you have the uh, Six of Cups reversed. So someone, if someone came into your life from the past, uh, it was just a flyby someone came in and left or you gave them another chance but it did not last all right let's see pisces future advice for my pisces again we will extend this reading to see what the partner want to tell you to get more in-depth information for you so you have the four of swords this is definitely energy of taking a break taking a time out um going into hiding going into meditation not trying to uh open up to other people maybe you're just kind of like done with everything but all the struggles all the fake friends foes whatever <sighs> okay so pisces yeah you're putting your listen you're you're no longer taking any slack from anyone all right you also might be um having insomnia a lot of type dreams i know i had some dreams about um some tea you have the world and a crazy big Gemini is reversed. So let, what's the, um, my favorite reading when I do tarot is the hidden secrets. But uh, let's see, um, future advice from my Pisces. Spirit. Speaking the truth. Ace of swords. And it landed on top of the hangman. So enlightenment. Someone might get enlightenment about this connection. Or you might feel like um, you you're searching for the truth here about how someone feel or just the truth of where you're supposed to be in life maybe this is your your energy here well perhaps it is your energy this is for pisces feeling stuck maybe you're asking for a hero or a rescue maybe you're just looking and searching for answers four of swords moon hidden secrets or you have a secret here and maybe someone is uh needing the truth or let's see hit it because we have to clarify before I even the magician okay so messages coming in as well eight of wands and justice here all right um gemini virgo energy so wanting the truth here was magic actually yesterday not yesterday 
our last reading we have divination which is spiritual as a healer so i apologize for that mistake you guys um i did correct myself and figure that out um so you might have a um a reconnection with either a libra a virgo gemini a pisces cancer here or crazy be gemini again someone wants to speak the truth so someone is manifesting whoa okay when i said manifesting the ten of pentacles came out which is stability and money and finance so you you're probably searching for a better place to live a place to to settle down um maybe you have to to go back to the drawing board figure out where you want to be what you want to do five of cups also um the grass wasn't greener you have the seven the nine of pentacles reversed the ace of pentacles so something wasn't stable all right and um the page of pentacles a lot of money finances here but the grass wasn't greener or you wasn't happy where the place you decided to go you have insomnia still the queen my queen of cups is reversed now we're going to do this reading a whoa a little different <laughs> pisces the cards let's see let's take it something flew on the floor here wow the sun healing beautiful this could be a child this is trying to find your happiness. And we have some more cards on the table here. And the emperor is reversed. Um, okay, wow. So the five of pentacles flew out of my hand. Literally, it's like some, someone took it out of my hand. Seven of swords. Um, sneaky behavior. Feeling left out in the cold. Um, feeling like there's some, some answers is missing. Wow, you have heavy Aries, le Aries reversed. A new beginning or not taking this leap of faith. You also have the four of cups. Someone could be rejecting this, uh, uh, a cup or offer of love or some type of beginning here. Um, or maybe it's a slight delay. All right? So you have a delay with an Aries, perhaps, or with just a new beginning, fresh starts. You're feeling left out in the cold or not really at your fullest with the seven of swords and the five of pentacles. So you're trying to find your happiness and where you belong here in life which is okay so let's before we clarify oh okay spirit is leading me to this selenite healing so maybe you need to take some selenite go outside hold it hold it and manifest pray what is the oracle message for whoa that was <laughs> stargaze see that's what i'm saying take the stone go outside and stargaze <laughs> and manifest this was like to the point when you gaze at the stars, you give yourself fairy focus. Your intuition will flow more freely and reveal what you need to know about your situation. You could have found out someone was not being a true friend. Um, yeah, getting that a lot. <laughs> so let's clarify for my Pisces. Um, why is the moon here for Pisces for the hidden secrets? Um, most likely the readings will be done this way until I decide to change it in a different way. Let's see the moon. Pisces. You have heavy. No, this is nine of, nine of wands. <laughs> Defensive. Get out of my head. Get out of my space. Um, nine of wands reverse. Also, ten of sewers. Not trusting. Someone could have hurt you. Someone could have had secrets. Someone could have been... You know, talking behind your back. Another one for the moon. Well, we have two more. So we have the nine, 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 and the palace of swords. All right, someone from your past, also crazy be Gemini, and the nine of coins. Someone is single. Someone, okay, this is someone who's thinking of themselves, selfish maybe. It could be another Pisces, Cancer, a crazy be Gemini, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Or this could be you holding on to your independence secretly not telling people want to be single maybe let's do one more for the moon for pisces three of wands online dating waiting for something waiting for messages to come in a ace of cups from someone you love or someone who loved you might be waiting for a message from you yeah this is someone from the past six of cups so you guys are that they are waiting for some type of message. All right, I have to move that out the way. Why is the two of swords reversed for Pisces? The world and the high priestess. Oh my goodness! Wow. 
Wow, wow, and more wow. Okay. Wow, and have faith. Absolute beautiful. And you have this King of Swords at the bottom. And the Ace of Swords. Of course, you be Gemini. So someone might want to speak the truth. Someone might be praying for a reconnection with you. Someone might be feeling bad for, for words they said to you, maybe. Have hidden secrets again. Also, the world, which is Scorpio, Aquarius, Leo, and Taurus. Okay, so you have the world travel, distance, secrets. Someone in the distance could be thinking about you or you're thinking about them or refuse it to see. Go and just quiet. I see a lot of silence on your part. Um, traveling, um, keeping things to yourself, not really revealing things. All right, so that is your energy. Also, you might have an Aquarius Super Gemini who's thinking about you maybe praying for a second chance here. Okay, um... Yeah, let's see what else. Ace of Swords. Yeah, and the Fool taking a sleep of faith. Speaking the truth. Someone wants a new beginning. And the Queen of Swords. So now you have a couple. You have the King of Swords between the High Priestess and Faith. So someone could be thinking about you, about the truth, wanting to have a second chance with you. If it's not an air sign, definitely a water sign. Or uh, And you have the Palace of Cups. And 11-11 is here. It's like wanting to have a second chance, wanting to, to rehash this. It could also be anyone in this world's card, which is Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, and Scorpio. All right. Um, yeah, so then you have also the moon, which is Pisces, Cancer. All right, so a lot of energy here for you, Pisces. A lot of people are reminiscing, or you, know, you are reminiscing. We have the grass wasn't greener, is it? No, four of cups, rejection, and the queen of coins, Aquarius, Super Gemini, eight of swords in your head about a rejection a rejection or someone is thinking about a rejection here let's see why is the four of wands commencement here which is the uh seven of wands defensive energy reverse again so someone this is you uh, twice like defensive reverse seven and nine of wands defending the fact of how you see things all right why is the hangman here Okay, so Ace of Wands reversed, pulling back your energy, pulling back your passion. No longer just um, easily to be fooled here for you, Pisces. Um, pulling back your sexual passion. No longer feeling that energy. Okay, maybe you just need a break. Taking the time out from everything. It's just moving or was moving too quickly. Too many people, too many options at once. Why is the Four of Swords here? Five of coins reversed. The feeling left out in the cold. Someone could have walked away from this situation. This could be you as well. Feeling like uh, things are not going your way. Not satisfied with things. Or someone kind of like just abruptly just walked away from this connection. And uh, maybe this person or you are regretful. And now someone wants to speak the truth. Ace of Swords. Why is this here? Ace of Swords. We have the Eight of Cups. Okay, so yeah, again, walking away. Palace of Swords, a crazy the Gemini. So a crazy the Gemini, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio again here. Um, wanting to speak the truth, needing the truth, wanting answers from someone who decided to take a leap of faith to walk away from you. Well, you took this leap of faith in another direction. And we have the King of Co King of Swords again, Ace of Swords again. All right, so yeah, a lot of a lot of air here and water. A lot of Gemini, Pisces, Cancer. Why is the Magician here? Virgo as well. The Strength, Leo. And we have the Sun here. So, um, alright. I will say for sure, if it's a Gemini, Virgo, or a Leo, this person is trying to hold on to their pride, their egos in a way. Okay, um, they might also be waiting for you to come back to them, but I see that you're not. You're remaining quiet. Okay, you're just drifting away slowly. Someone is drifting and someone is not trying to return. Hangman again. And the fool. So you have a beginning and ending here. You have the ending first and then a new beginning. So you might have to just end things with this person who hurt you. Move towards new love to receive the sun. 
Why is the Ten of Pentacles here for my Pisces? Stability, money, finances. Wow. And it kind of... Wow, it's powerful. Let's see. Eight of Wands messages coming in, text messages. Or you might get a new job offer. You, you definitely have a message for you waiting, Pisces. Okay, Eight of Wands. I want to clarify the Ten of Pentacles and Eight of Wands again. The Emperor Aries. Wow. So you have a new beginning or actually Pisces. And here's the Page of Cups. Someone is refusing to um, to uh, let go of their ego or egotistical ways. Or you might be connecting with an Aries or someone with Aries in the chart. Um, Eight of Wands. The message is coming in from a, perhaps an Aries or Leo, Sagittarius. Also, you have Virgo, Gemini, Leo, and heavy Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces, Cancer here. Um, I can also tell you it was distance that played a part in this connection as well. Okay, you guys were not connected close together physically. So let's see what the sun is about. Um, yeah, the ego is the emperor or you have an Aries coming towards you who's going to start a, re or a brand new start with you. And this person might be more committal. So spirit heard you, received you, magician here. Um, so you need to just let go. Unstuck yourself from this other connection. This person could have been very good intimately, but... Um, Spirit is telling you to walk away from it because it's no longer serving you. Even in their company, you feel alone. That's a problem. So that's not happiness. Happiness will be here if you decide to move away. Why is the sun? So you have two queens. Wow. Queen of Wands, Aerzio Sag, and the Taurus Capricorn Virgo here. Two women, two feminine energies with the sun definitely a uh, female energy feminine energy you have the chariot and the devil reversed and the four cups magician is also here emperor libra you could have had so many fallouts with so many people and aries another pisces libra taurus virgo gemini capricorn and a cancer you could have had so many fallouts and uh, maybe this is perhaps why you feel like you need to be single because of all these past pain you cannot bear to hold and handle anymore. All right, so you have a connection with the Aries, Leo, Sag, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo for your future advice here. Leo, Aries, strongly, Virgo, um, Gemini. But mostly I see a, air, a fire sign and a... Taurus Capricorn Virgo here who could be more compatible for you coming towards your future here also if you're not dealing with anyone for my singles have an ace of pentacles a new house a new a new beginning here fresh start you for my single people you might be focusing on your beauty also stability finances especially with this Virgo nine of coins here what is your advice you might be focusing on your own self. Yeah, your advice is here. Don't leave yourself out in the cold. Think about your own self here. Beauty, finances. Or someone feels like you're not good enough is what I see here. Let's get another one for the Five of Pentacles for the advice for Pisces. You have the King of Pentacles. Now you have a couple, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, stability. Focus on your stability. Spirit is leading you to that. You have the Eight of Cups, the Wheel of Fortune reverse, and the King of Cups reverse. So you're upset. Um, someone walked away, but now someone wants to return. Or maybe you made a wrong choice. You're battling. Maybe you're fighting yourself because you made a wrong choice in love. You have the Death card reverse and Nine of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles twice. Focus on your self-growth. And end the cycle because spirit is not here to help you with the will of karma reversed. Stargazing, healing. So this is your reading. Let's see what the partner want to tell you and the hidden secrets. <laughs>